Giant Rock Kennels, man. We here with Samson the Great, man. You know what I'm saying? 150 pound, humongous Rottweiler, man. You know what I'm saying? He gets all the accolades. He's not even two yet, man. You know what I'm saying? We keep him in shape, man. You know what I'm saying? Give him the best of everything. You're not going to see a blemish or anything on him. Man. Up, Samson. Up. First tip right there. That's how you get your dog up, right? Bam. So, we bring Samson and Delilah today. Delilah's one of the biggest, beautiful female Rottweilers in the game man you know what i'm saying up samson we did a uh we already did the sperm extraction and i'm just going to give you some tips on how to make sure you have a successful artificial insemination breeding with your dogs man you feel me of the highest quality first tip is when you're getting semen from the boy you see what i'm doing tapping him right here it's gonna keep him up but to make sure he don't go anywhere you want to grab him from the back you grab him right between his junk and where his nuts is at. Right there, you're gonna feel some balls. Hold on, Samson, stay still. You're gonna feel a ball right between there. You wanna grab that and squeeze it just a little bit, just like this or something. The penis will extend, and if you have a female in heat, you have her in front of him, and he'll start releasing semen. You don't wanna get a lot of semen. This is really all you need, a few cc's, because anything else is just gonna be bladder fluid that you don't need. And if you're shipping it, that's just gonna help uh, make the semen um, die faster. You know what I'm saying? So you wanna make sure you just get a little bit. Now, another tip, when you do actually inseminate the female, you wanna lit in your finish, you wanna do a lock. You wanna lock it in, you wanna keep your finger in the vagina for at least five minutes, tap it. When you tap the back, it'll make the female flag. Once the female flags, she'll clinch her pelvis bones, and that'll help her receive the semen. You do that for about five minutes with the lock in, and it, once you insert this tip in, and you should have a successful breeding. Other than that, man, you know what I'm saying? You want to make sure your dog is in the proper heat. Me, I count about 10 days when I see the first bleeding, and then I go on the 12th day. Uh, anything after that, usually, because after the 10th day, that's when she stops bleeding. She might still be bleeding. Any day after that, the, um, the blood should be clear. She should be ready. They say she should be ready to breed anywhere after two weeks. So, also, you feel me, we do at least two or three um, artificial inseminations just to make sure our female takes, man. And after that, man, you know what I'm saying? We end up with, you feel me, beautiful rock wilders that look just like these, man. Hey, I'm K. Cole, and this giant rock, rock kills, you know? And if you're looking for a dog from us, man, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you check us out, man, and put your deposit in. We got some rock wilders on the way. We're taking the best care of them, the best quality, man. You know what I'm saying? Plus, we just like to share, you know what I'm saying, our secrets to how we get these dogs this way. You know what I'm saying? Hey, thanks for checking in. I'm cold, man.